So for Flunderies, combos are often a very simple normal Rubina to search Elglin, to normal Elglin, to search Inpin, to search a spell and trap. That's a very fine base for a combo, but it's extremely vulnerable to most hand traps. That's where the Flunderies field spell comes into play, as well as Book of Moon. The Flunderies field spell lets us banish one Flunderies from deck to get an extra normal summon of a level 1 Flunderies from hand. This sets up for the Flunderies and Vanish Zone effect of letting us add them back to hand when another Winged Beast monster is normal summoned. This happens after when the normal summon effect activates, meaning it chain blocks the effect. Cards like Ash Blossom and Joy Spring can only be activated on the last card in a chain, so this is a chain block that protects our monster's effects, and note it is normally going to be used to protect Elglin to search out our main tribute options. Another common method of dodging hand traps is using Book of Moon to flip down our own monsters to dodge hand traps like Infinite and Permanence by making them miss target. These strategies in combination with Called by the Grave and Cross Out Designator make for an insanely hand trap resistant deck that's also able to mess with the current meta extremely effectively.